Say she don't catch her and see her she fresh. Okay. <laughs> Madam, welcome to the show this morning. Good morning. Ah, you look really calm, really nice. Be like say Corona no day <laughs> your side. No, it not happen for your for your surrounding. <laughs> no, I mean it's everywhere, definitely. But okay, yeah, okay, okay. So today we are talking about the hospitality business, and we know say yes. So uh, that really uh, the pandemic really affects this thing, and uh, for across the world, not be only in Nigeria it happen, and uh, people can't find ways. The 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 that industry be shut down for a bit. Uh, because people know if you travel, people know if you do all the normal movement where they do. Now, the pandemic still there, and the industry needs to cope. Yes. Things need to happen. So, what's the new uh, coping mechanism where this industry don't say, okay, we'll go put in place to help uh, this hospitality business come back up alive? Um, definitely, one of the things is innovation. Okay. We innovation. have to be innovative. Mm -hmm. Um, but another thing is just being dynamic in mm -hmm. what it is that you're trying to do. So adaptability mm -hmm. and innovation. Mm -hmm. I think those are the two major things. Mm -hmm. um, a lot of hospitality industry um, establishments have been doing the same thing for a number of years. So okay. you have a restaurant, you're serving the same food, yeah. you're doing the same thing. Mm -hmm. But obviously now... You have to change. You yes, have to so. adapt to the times. Yes, you have so. to change what you're doing. And then also, so that's the innovative part. Okay. And then adaptability. How do you get your food from point A to point B? True. Without people coming without in. Without people coming so in. So how yes. do you do that? So yes. adaptability and innovation, I think those are the two major things. And there's so much we can talk about around mm -hmm. that. Mm -hmm. So yeah, mm -hmm. I think for it, that's Adaptability the and innovation. Yes. Yeah, as things are coming, it makes sense. Because like <laughs> if they say, how you move your food from point A to point B, because people don't want to go out again. Yeah. Say, ah, no, I, I, I don't <laughs> trust that environment. If I go sit down there now, no, no, waiting to happen. But exactly. you know that in, in, and in moving your food from point A to point B, exactly. or your, your, you know, we know say, that safe can have a lot of you know issues on its own because of the transport mm. moving from here and the waiting the food go face on the road getting to the place where it's supposed to get to how um, um this hospitality um, side don't fit cover up all those lapses where they happen in the moving from point a to point b regarding this your your food where you want to carry go around okay first of all you said issues yes I don't see it as issues. Okay. I see it as opportunities. Okay. So definitely a lot of opportunities have come back. I understand what you're saying about it being challenging, mm -hmm. but they're challenging opportunities. So you say a lot of people are changing their product. Mm. So a lot of logistics companies have started. Yes. A lot of um, you know people thinking about like um, the chef Eros, he's doing fresh prep, something okay. like that, okay. where you make your own dinner. So they go right pepper, maggi, mm. chicken, mm -hmm. everything, and then mm -hmm. you can cook in your house with directions. So okay. fantastic things like that. But um, one of the things that a lot of people have to bear in mind is contact. Okay. So contactless movements. Yeah. I think that's the only thing that you need to just worry about. Mm -hmm. The less people that the food is going through, the less people that are touching in the hotels, the doors and yeah, things like that yeah. is better. Do you know what I mean? And mm -hmm. I think that's the future. Do you know what I mean? Mm. In Nigeria, we have a person for everything. True. When you travel abroad, how many people, Ibo people fill up their own tank, do you mm -hmm, know what I mean? Mm -hmm. You fill your tank, you pay your money, you go, you don't, you don't meet anybody. But yes. yeah, we need to keep doing that. Yeah. You know, everybody for something. For something so remove yeah. those middlemen. I know it, employability is not happening. Uh -huh, now, we say, we say, because if you remove those middlemen now, work don't come up for people hand. But that's where innovation mm -hmm. comes up, do you mm -hmm. know what I mean? A lot of businesses have started this pandemic. A lot of people see it as, oh my God, it's so bad. But people are making money in this pandemic. Pandemic, true, true. a lot of money true. do you know what I mean so you have to think outside the box what what am I doing that can be sold mm -hmm. do you know what I mean and there's so many things like like I said logistics has gone haywire that one, yes, you know yes. and there's so many other businesses that have streamed up like events like zoom parties yeah event planners doing zoom parties I'm sure you've got some jello fries uh, to your house uh, already yes. for weddings <laughs> yeah, exactly so yeah. you know you're thinking outside the box people mm -hmm. are doing smaller weddings but they're still entertaining bigger crowds yeah. so you, you just have to think a little bit sit down find out what your industry is lacking, and then deliver a service. Mm, but yeah. you know that uh, when you talk about innovation, uh, mm. because uh, of the things we they used to for this part of the mm. world, we like to party, we like to come <laughs> together, we like to meet, we like to, we like to just be in the same space, enjoying ourselves. Of course. And this new creativity we they bring up, say, okay, well, we do Zoom party, you mm. day your house, they watch us online. <laughs> uh, it, we, don't, we don't really feel... Uh, that whole thing anymore. Mm. We don't feel that that presence, that whole level of enjoyment what they usually they feel. Mm. And on the other hand, it also they expensive because if now online now, mm. uh, I go need to 
get internet for phone. Mm -hmm. I go need to get light. Mm -hmm. I go need to, you know, so and all these things for this part of the world, this is our country with the they are not really easy to access for everybody. Mm. So you go tell me say now the the way the thing take change. You can't be like say now to just favor some certain kind of people <laughs> where we afford them mm. or say how they want how they how not they change the scope. Now we go also benefit those people with the outside. We know if you right. also get this enjoyment. We you know this certain sex to sell people internet mm. light all those kinds of things. Here now they put all these things into concentration too. Okay, so one of the things that is definitely advisable in the industry is social distancing. Yeah. So, you know, social distancing, it seems like such a simplistic thing, but mm -hmm. it can go such a long way. Mm -hmm. So I'm sat here, you're sat here, someone else is sat here, someone mm -hmm. else sat there. We've already worked out, it's a party, do you know what I mean? It mm. may not be as inclusive. Yes, you want to owe and bear and yeah, dance and everything. Yeah, I know what you want to spray money. <laughs> you want to spray money, <laughs> but you can give them the bundle. Yeah, you know I mean? what I mean? Like I said, we're just changing how we do things. So for mm -hmm. the people that can't afford those luxuries, mm -hmm. you know, of data and things like that, yes. obviously you can still do it, but you just bear in mind space and okay. physical contact. Okay. So you put like, it was a six centimeters in between each person, yes. something like that, and then you can still have a party, you mm. know, and then wash your hands, True. don't touch your face, True. the food should compact, not open, not open. no buffet, mm -hmm. you know, things like that. So there are definitely ways around it. Mm. Um, for restaurants and dining, two centimeters, whether it's a buka or a five-star restaurant, mm -hmm. still make space. Make that space. Do you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Make space, less capacity. L Lagos State has said 50% capacity. Yes. Do you know what I mean? Maintain a number. Maybe if you're going to a restaurant, if you have 10 people, normally have five. Mm -hmm. Once you have five in the restaurant, don't let anybody else in, you know, things like like that but also I think the benefit of this is our um, internet providers and yes. things like that they are forced to do better true because you know they're, they're so used to mediocre yeah, yeah, you buy 420 mm, the data will give you two yeah, the rest will just be, just be a voicemail yeah, exactly but now they, they have to they have to provide these things yes. and people are looking at them like guy oh yeah hurry up. Oh, yeah it's double up because exactly. we are spending more exactly. on the, the data you have exactly. to give us the, the service exactly. rights hmm. so hmm. yeah so that's a good thing for us interesting uh thank you this conversation <laughs> makes sense but uh, because of time we need to to, to wrap them up that's here but we'll definitely call you back but we this matter well yes. uh, because the conversation too makes sense and as, as you talk I mean, don't give us better ideas <laughs> on how people within this industry go fit you know create uh, things you talk to people they make money for this pandemic yeah money they, they flow things they move around the money they say money no deal uh, <laughs> money they happen all right we just they speak to uh in it me and then uh, she give us this better better uh, information madam thank you very much for joining us on the show thank this morning you. You know? it makes sense and we'll definitely bring you again next time thank so you. can give us a better insight because me i like to groove uh, i know they i know they like I like to groove. <laughs>